Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another Monday plan with me. It feels so long since I last spoke to you guys, even though it's only been a week, but I missed it. So I'm happy to be back this week. Um, it is my fiance's birthday this week, so that's why I'm using the male themed kit, which is from my shop, as obviously he's not all into hearts and roses and flowers, so that's why I have chosen this kit this week. So I've just given you a quick flip through of the kit and I'm also pulling in some washi. This is like a silver geometric looking washi because I wanted something still kind of pretty and yes I could have used something a lot smaller to cut my washi but that was my son's ruler and that's what I had to hand so that's what I used. I then went in with the date covers and put them along the top. So I decided to switch out the washi from the kit, the bottom washi that comes, and I just used the silver washi just to try and lighten it up a little bit. And then we're going to go in day by day. So the first thing is that my children go back to school because it was half term last week. So I just used one of the sad poppets and wrote down back to school. I'm expecting a delivery on Monday, which is going to be my new mic. So hopefully I'll be able to film better with my monthly spreads where I'm not doing a voiceover I can actually talk and you guys can hear me <laughs> so that should be coming today and then obviously I want to upload this plan with me so I used two strips of washi and a half box which I just flipped up onto its side and I also used the YouTube sticker that comes with my freebie I've also got an important phone call to make on Monday so I just used the don't forget sticker which is also on my freebie and a little phone icon because I need to call the council just to get my up to date council tax bill and then I just used a full box and I've got two TV things on, I've got Keeping Up With The Kardashians and I've recently started watching Project Runway, I used to watch it a while ago. There's lots of things that I used to watch a while ago and they kind of pop up on Now TV, no Netflix sorry and I'm like oh. Yeah, I'll watch that again. So I like to watch things while I'm designing or while I'm kind of doing things around the house. I will just put that on and watch it in the background. So for Tuesday, I put down a today header and it's actually a payday. So I just use a piece of washi and the payday sticker that comes with the kit. And then I'm expecting another delivery on Tuesday, which is quite exciting because I bought some Tombow brush pens. Um, so hopefully they'll be here on Tuesday. I have got one Tombow pen and I've been using it and it's so good like I love the pen I'm also going up to the city shopping as I need to finish getting the bits for my fiance's birthday which is on Wednesday so I just put a little happy pop it down and write down city shopping on a half box I then put my full box down just to block off some time and then I noticed that I don't really use a lot of little things so I'm trying to use more of them in a spread normally I'll use like half boxes and quarter boxes and I don't often use headers either so I'm trying to incorporate them more in my spreads and just change things up a little bit so I just use four little things here ones for my daughter to study homework to do and then I've got a TV program on and I want to edit a video my hair keeps getting in the way because I've got it up in like a top knot mum bun thing clearly I can't do that when I'm trying to film and then on Wednesday like I said it's my partner's birthday so I just put down a half box with a birthday poppet from the birthday sheet It's also a cleaning day for me on Wednesday because my fiance is still going to work so I have just put down the cleaning time sticker with a piece of washi and then a checklist which I will fill in. And then at the bottom there I just used another full box which is one of my favourites in the kit. Flipping it over to Thursday I used a half box with a little poppet with a laptop on its head as I'm going to be designing on Thursday morning and then to block off some time I just used another full box. If any of you saw my Instagram post today, I have actually bought a bullet journal. I have been talking about doing a bullet journal for so long and I always keep putting it off and even though I didn't have it in January, I kind of used that as an excuse as, oh well, never mind, maybe I'll do one next year. And I was like, Laura, no, you're going to buy one. So I did buy one. It has came already and I'm thinking about uploading the kind of February spread 
it's not really a spread well the February part in my bullet journal that I have done which is more like my tester month to see how it all works so I was going to edit that and put that up on Thursday if any of you are interested in a bullet journal video from me then let me know down in the comments I totally don't have to upload them I can just do them myself but if you would like to see bullet journal videos from me then let me know and my first one should go up on Thursday Anyway, getting back to the plan with me. So um, I used a little thing to mark for the black bins to go out. My daughter will have a study hour and then I have two TV programs on, which is Friends, Project Runway, and then I'm gonna treat myself to a nice bubble bath. So for Friday I've got a payday so I just put down, oh I forgot to put my header down first so I just put my header down and then I put down my payday and I just use one of the extra long page flags that comes with the kit and just write down payday and then I have also got two bills due on this day, I've got rent and my council tax bill so I put those down and then I used one of the crying poppets with holding like the bills and I just put that in between them. So I do want to film on Friday so I used a piece of washi with a half box that I flipped up onto its side and then I realised the upload icon would look better where I have put down for the bullet journal so I just used the film slate and used that on the Friday one as I want to film my plan with me and possibly my Hello March spread I may do that next week it kind of just depends how Friday goes but I don't want to be late as I'm finally going to put up another monthly spread and with two failed monthly spreads hopefully the third is the better one i also put down a small page flag and then another half box as me and my fiance will be going out to celebrate like his birthday so my children will be sleeping at my mum's house and then i just put down date night and the two little poppets with the drinks are from the friends sheet and then I put down this page flag and I don't actually know why I put it down. I didn't write anything. I haven't got anything planned for Friday. So I don't know why I've done that. But moving on to the weekend, I just put the today headers down and then my weekend banner. And then for Saturday, I put the family icon as my children will be dropped back off home after sleeping at Nanny's house. And then I'll just write down the time when I know. And then here it kind of goes a little bit all funny because I filled out my Saturday and it wasn't until I moved on to Sunday I realised that I'd missed something out on Saturday so this does all change in a little while but I was just going to mark down the housework that I wanted to do. Luckily I didn't fill in the checklist yet because that would have been bad as I had to move everything which you will see in a minute. And then I filled up the bottom there with some little things for Project Runway. We'll probably watch a movie with the boys. My daughter will have a study hour and I couldn't remember why I put the last one down but this is where I realised so then I just go back onto Saturday and I move the housework section over to Sunday because I'll just do all of that on Sunday morning and this housework sticker just it wouldn't go down straight <laughs> And then as I went to put the checklist down, I realised you're going to see the pink line. So I just went and got some Tipex or Whitetail or whatever you want to call it. I don't often use this because it just always ends up a mess with me. I can't get it down nice and smooth. It just, it always looks a mess. So I wasn't that happy with it, but that kind of covered the pink line, which is what I wanted. And then I put down a half box on the Saturday with a little Dr. Poppet to mark down for the opticians because like I said before I use the Dr. Poppets for any medical appointments or opticians. I also put down a short to buy list as we're in town we will probably pick up a few things. And then moving back to Sunday I just put my Poppet checklist down and then another full box at the bottom. And then here I just went back up and filled out what I wanted to clean on Sunday morning. And then my camera does shut off in a little while, but that's literally all you missed is me putting in the last thing on my checklist and also filled in my bill headers. Okay, flipping over to the sidebar. I just started with some silver washi to frame the full box. And then I actually decided to use the washi because I really liked this washi instead of using a full box. So I just layered all of that together. I just thought it looked really cute and I really liked it up there. 
Then I'm just going to carry on with my usual sidebar setup. So I have my two habit trackers, which I usually split up by putting a piece of washi in between. And then I always have a next week section because I find that really useful. I kind of get a bit lost if I don't have one. So I just use the header next week and put down another checklist. And then at the bottom there, I just had enough room for my last full box. It wasn't until I was filling out my next week section I realised how close we are to March. I'm really not ready for March yet so I need to get a shift done next week and get everything into order. Now I'm just going to put the deco down and I was doing it so well this year on calming down on the deco because I was just going crazy with it all the time. And then it got to this spread and I don't know what happened. I reverted back to my old ways and just had to use every piece of deco. It just makes me really happy putting deco stickers down. And then at the end everything looks really crowded. But I just, I don't know. I'm addicted to putting deco stickers down. And I, it was going okay up until I got down to the bottom here and had the ties left and the cigar. And I was just like, yep, yeah, we're just gonna, we're gonna put them everywhere. And then I kind of took a step back and was like, Laura, seriously, that's enough stickers. So then I do end up taking those ties up and just reminding myself that, you know, it's just too many. Just, you don't need it. But then I did feel bad. So then I put the ties down the side of the page because why not? That was it though for this week's spread. I hope you guys liked it. I know it's a little bit different for a February spread as it's not all hearts and roses. But like I said, it was my fiance's birthday and I didn't want to give him something too girly in his weekly spread. But make sure you give me a thumbs up if you do like it. And if you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe. I will be having a bullet journal video out on Thursday. So make sure you look out for that guys. And I hope you all have a really lovely week and I will see you on Thursday. Bye guys.